Welcome back to another Squadcast once again with Gabo the Great. And Rifo the Greatest. Whatever. It is what it is. Hey, Gabo, let's jump into it, bro. All right. Topics. Let's do this. We got some topics to talk about today. Three topics. Of nice. Gaming and retro video game or toy related. But the first one, Gabo, in Gabo's words. Wait, video- wait, wait. Yes. Wait. You look good, bro. Oh, thank you. What are you eating? Not much. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Lots of water. Oh, thanks, man. Um, oh, you really like that, huh? Uh, thank you. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I'm wearing a tight shirt. Maybe that's what it is. I don't know. Uh, but video game music and sound effects, which generation did it the best? Gabo, I'll let you uh, start with that. Go first. Okay. Uh, let me Let me start this then because I have it kind of queued up a little bit. Um, I don't know what's playing here, but I thought it was Super Nintendo stuff is what I'm saying. Um, Yeah, I think the best, and obviously this is in terms of what you believe to believe to be the best. Really, there is no definitive answer. For me, I find my favorite sound effects, favorite music, favorite groove, favorite actual sound coming out of a console um, or a TV hooked up to a console would be the Super Nintendo generation. Uh, And what I love... 16-bit generation and what I really like the best about it is that I think the Super Nintendo always made their music sound really like orchestrated orchestral if that's a word uh, really warm really full really vibrant Uh, you know as it's been said a million times Sega has a good sound as well but it was more like gritty edgy rock and roll Super Nintendo was yeah and Super Nintendo felt more like an orchestra like like I don't know, like I felt like there was a group of people playing it who are music majors, which is good. And then I felt like Sega's was always more like rock and roll guys in the garage, which is great. Not saying this is a Nintendo versus Sega thing, but just all in all, when I think through generations, you know, the Wii, GameCube, Nintendo has great ones as well. But I think my heart lies the most with Super Nintendo. When I hear Super Nintendo music, even Final Fantasy III, man, some of the songs I'm just like, oof, oof, that is, that is a beautiful sounding console all right yes, for sir. me yes i think there's two generations okay. well three well two generations that you can recognize the sounds a okay. bit a bit and 16 bit of course after 16 bit uh almost all the games almost sure. go back go to cd quality uh, yeah you're right i didn't think so, of that. so i agree with you i will say 16 bit 16 bits uh, your answer too, okay. Yeah, especially because I remember the first time I, I play uh, Master Higgin games. What was the name? Adventure Island. Adventure, Super Adventure Island. Yeah, Super, was Super Nintendo was Super and Adventure Island. The Super Nintendo one. And you remember the music? Oh, yeah. It Actually, was amazing. Gabo, I'm not lying to you. It's really weird you're saying that. I was doing some work from my home office in here about an hour yeah. ago. And I yep. was listening to the Adventure Island soundtrack. Yeah. And also, one of the greatest for me, uh, one of the best soundtracks in a video game, yeah. Super Castlevania. Oh, that's so good, man. Castlevania so, has it on lockdown. So, so that's what I'm saying, man. You can, you, for me, I begin seeing the different in sounds and how, how the, the de- developers put more time in the music after the 16 bit Got even it. even genesis game yeah. even genesis game yeah so so yeah man for me i think the you know i mean if we want to name like some of our top favorite sounds yeah. or whatever from the super nintendo uh, i would say super metroid is a big one for atmosphere yeah. uh, very atmospheric uh ricky would attest to this one uh, donkey kong country ricky yeah. for i think two of his four kids to put them to bed he plays aquatic ambience which is one of the, the underwater level songs uh in donkey kong country and uh, if i have to pick another one i mean i don't i think for fun hype i really like the super mario kart uh soundtrack uh, batman returns with the dark feels as well uh okay i yeah uh, well i already mentioned super castlevania yep you got your three right all right, Super Castlevania. Yep. Uh, uh, Super Adventure Island. Okay. And the third one for me. Uh oh. Star Fox. Oh, such a good one. 
Such yep. a good answer. Yep. Such a good answer. I love that sound. It, it gets you going. It kicks in. Dun, 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 so dun, good. Dun, 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 oh, see? And I actually like the sound effects of, yeah. them, of them talking better yeah. than I like. Obviously, the do a barrel and it's slippy. Yeah. Ah! I There's like boat, those, boat, boat, boat. but I like uh, that uh, better. I like that better. Yeah. Yeah, so very, good. And you remember the intro in the first day oh, when beautiful. they are flying oh, in the corridor? It kicks, <sighs> kicks butt, man. It kicks butt. Yeah, amazing. See, yeah. now I want to play it. Let's go. Let's just. Like nice. It. See, yeah. see, that's the that's the beauty of video games. Retro oh, yeah. video games. Yeah, it does it. It does it for you. Um, all right, what's our next topic? All right, Gabo. Next question you had. It was uh, when right. playing video games. Ooh, this is a good one for you. When playing video games. Are you picky with your setup? And what we mean by that is like the type of TV you're playing on, the cables, CRT, sound. Are you a, 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 a snob, so to say, with you know playing your consoles? You can answer that. Yes, I'm super picky. For me, uh, you know, putting on some gameplay. Um, right now, like two weeks ago, I, I bought another TV, perfect for the, yeah. in, in preparation for yes. PS5 and Series X. Yeah, great console. Uh, yeah, and I'm very picky. I always uh, try to buy the, the best cable, the yeah. best HDMI, yeah. the best uh, TV quality. Um, the best, for example, in PS4, when they announced the PS Pro, yeah. I bought it day one, the same with the X. I want to take full advantage of what it, of, it of the of the console or, and how to see it. it. Um, Remember like one or two months ago, I bought a, a device for the Switch that makes the game look super good. And trust me, it makes the difference. It's the amp cable. It looks the different. Probably, you know, always... yeah. No, I was saying, yeah, uh, getting to know you through the past few years, yeah, I've noticed Gabo is definitely very into cables, in which I necessarily wasn't ever that way with my setup, you know, especially with retro games. I, I feel guilty. <laughs> yeah, I'll be honest, Gabo kind of is the one who got me into, not my retro stuff, I necessarily, yeah, but Gabo is, Gabo likes to have his retro stuff play really nice and clean, yeah. and buys all the retro tink and all that, and next gen. Yeah. I never worried about either of those, but now I got to say I'm picky with my new stuff, my next gen, my Xbox One X. Definitely will be getting a Series X, a PS5. And yeah. since then, I've bought in three 4K uh, HDR TVs. You know, I've bought in even, even sound. I've bought sound bars and different sound speakers because I, like you said, now that it's the newer stuff and I know we're pushing hardware and checking out, you know, things and better visuals and supposedly... Yeah better you know styles of graphics i want to experience them like in their full glory and i'm and i'm it, doing it and i've loved it i i i got another example i'm yeah. still waiting for my polymega oh, yeah. uh, from a year now yeah. and i didn't touch the saturn that i bought from ricky yeah and the sega cdx i i didn't touch it nothing of that because i know I can play and I can see it better in the Polymega. Yeah. So, so that's that's a small example. Got it. And I mean, that's me. That's me. It's like remember the other day we was talking uh, with the gaming of the grid, Ross, and we was talking about that. They love playing their old consoles, yes. like they used to be. In yeah. CRT, they have a... Well, and even with their new stuff, they were saying that they refuse to buy a new TV until yeah. their TV breaks, which is, I get it. That's that's a good way to save money. I get it. Not yeah, I get money. it. I respect that. I think it's, it's awesome. Yeah. But and, it's not for us. <laughs> yeah. But it's not for me, to be yeah. honest. It's yeah. not for me. So in small words, I will say I prefer to play a, a retro video game. Got it. In a collection. For Got example, it. I prefer to, to play Super Mario in the Switch now than in the right console, right? In the in the OG console. Yeah. In the NES, in the original NES. Gabby, yeah. I mean, Do you see what yeah. game's playing right there? Do you see what oh you missed it. It, it was yeah, it was Street I know. Fighter, but it, it yeah. moved. Now. now it's turtles. For now? Yes. What is that? That one? that one might be Ex hard. 
X-Men. Yeah, nice. Look at that guy. Look at that guy. What a smart man. Um, yeah, so uh, to each their own with it. But yeah, I, I, I'm not picky with my old school. Uh, but new school now I am. I used to not be. Thanks to Gabo. It cost me a lot of money. Yeah, uh, that, that's the other thing I was going to say. Yeah. It can it can get uh, expensive. Yeah. Especially for screens. So for TVs and everything. So. Got it. All right, we got one more. One more. One Mort? One one Mort. I love Mort. Here's our, our last, Mort! last question for this one. I like Let's this do it. one. Really? Best, best video game movies. Ooh. What's that's a hard one? that's a hard one. It's funny because th that this this topic gets so much hate, so to say, because people yeah. necessarily don't like video game movies. I've always enjoyed them more than I'd say the average person does. I've never really looked at them as horrible. I didn't necessarily base them off what they were like their video game counterpart. I would just kind of base them off movies and have fun with them. I'm really easy to please when it comes to movies, by the way. Let me ask you something before before we go in. Yeah. Do you like the Super Mario movie? Back in the days, I yeah. did. Back in the days, All I right. did. Me too. Got it. Me too. Not recently I watched it as adults and I'm like, this is weird. It's definitely not Mario. <laughs> Did I like the movie? No, but that's, I feel like I've become more critical of it because, you know, Mario is my, my jam in life. You know, I think it's better than street fighter, to be honest, the street fighter movie, street fighter movie has some great quotes. Well, yeah. Yeah. I will say that was one of the movies that I saw back then. And I really didn't like it. What's your favorite video game movie of all time? Uh, for me, yeah. I have to go with the first Resident Evil. Got it. That was a good one. I like that a lot. The first. And, yeah. and I don't know if we can count this as a, you know, real video game movie. Prince but I, No. Uh, Ready Player One. Yeah. I mean, yeah, necessarily not. It's a amazing. Yeah. yeah. But, well. It's like a well, love letter. It feels yeah. like let's stay I, I would stay with resident evil the first one the very got first it, got one got it got it got it what about you and sorry i was distracted my door was like doing weird things so um okay he's the ghost it's a ghost oh. i saw someone ask us to do another ghost conversation oh let's do it no not that many people watched it on youtube how dare you but all we no, can do it but we love talking about it i'll show we, you mine we, we oh. have well oh, go ahead we have, we have a lot of stories yeah. we have more to talk about go ahead. ghosts and all that go ahead. um Here's mine. And I will say that I love this movie, not even just for a video game movie. I just love this movie in general. Let's see if you, when you see what it is, Gab, already. Uh oh. Tell uh -oh. me when you, tell me when you recognize what movie this is. Wii U? This. Yes, it's the Wii U movie. Let's see how long it takes you to see what it is. Oh, Silent Hill? I love this movie, dude. But I the really first one. Yes. The first one. I the first, really, yeah, I forgot about that movie. The yeah, first one man. is amazing, bro, and it's gore. Yep, there's a lot of gore in this movie. Yeah, it's weird though. This movie, it it stuck pretty decently. I won't say good to like a Silent Hill feel, but I don't know. I feel like it got so much criticism. Of course, that's just how it is. But I went in there again, like we talked about in our last podcast, not like looking at reviews and not seeing yeah. what people said about it. And when I watched it as a hardcore Silent Hill fan, I enjoyed it for what it was. I like really liked the movie. Yeah. It's like it's like uh, the other day I watched uh, Doom again. Oh, nice. Yeah. And I really like it. And that's I what it comes down to. It's so funny when people, and people will probably argue with that in the comments. Gabo said, hey, that movie sucks, but- Yeah, according, according but I like Doom. it. But like you said, there is chocolate and there is and vanilla. Vanilla, you know. Can you that, imagine? Can you imagine a ghost and goblin movie? Also, oh, that'd be amazing, Gabo. You know what I never realized? Yeah. Until just recently, this lady right here, the cop. Oh, it's is uh that's uh Andrea, Walking Dead. That's what I wanted to say, but I couldn't find the clip. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> recently, I watched it again, and I was like, I never realized it was her. You know what uh, I mean? Me either. Yeah. I know because I watched that movie last year. Oh, and you're like, that was oh, so good, man. Yeah, yeah, so good. And then so Sonic good. recently coming out. Sonic, doing well, Sonic's really. It was really good, to be honest. Sonic I was, well. I was amazed. Yeah, 
Uh, what, what other movie? Supposedly, we've been in talks of a Mario Bros. movie for a very long time, like the past five years maybe, and supposedly it was going to be uh, Illumination, the same people that made Minions movies. But I haven't heard anything since then. I got other one. What is it? The, the very first one, Mortal Kombat. The first one. I like that movie. It's not amazing, but it's good. Back then, my, back then it was really good. And my sister was dating the guy who played Motaro in the in Annihilation. Really? Yeah. I didn't know you have a sister. You didn't know that? No. She is 43. She's She, not a girl. This is much. Do 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 do. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so good. yeah. No, she's uh, she's cool. She, but it's it's hard. we don't see each other as much because she's the oldest i'm the youngest oh okay in the family so yeah cool. but video game movies you know I, i i have fun with them for what they are i think they're fun to watch i think if you're a video gamer in general you owe it to yourself to see them just because it's fun even to mock how much they don't align you know i you, love the tomb raider movies with angelina jolie oh yeah you're gonna when you watch a video game movie you're gonna have two feelings or piece off or happiness <laughs> well, at this point it's like everyone's told you that they're not good and that is relative. yeah again but at this point so at least you can go and like being like i'm just gonna enjoy the silliness of what this is well it doesn't matter anymore because sonic was really good yeah sonic broke the mold so, so let's see yeah so that yeah and the first resident evil too oh. that's true well if we can get a good dragon's lair video game i'll be happy i mean dragon's lair movie right up there that'd be cool really yeah i like it dirk oh. man dirk's cool all right it's good stuff oh i thought it was playing back there but it's not so all right gabo let's uh let's er say goodbye say goodbye to the ones Did that you we say, love i thought you said say goodbye uh, yeah say oh sega say. just screwed up sega just screwed up bad 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 hey. boys hey do you guys want to see the new game gear micro here it is <laughs> oh, I got one too. Look at this. Oh, oh, pretty much, dude. Not oh, many people. Oh, that's Shinobi that. over there. Oh, it's Sonic. Sonic's the size hey, of a pixel. Hey, you can see Sonic. It's blue. Look at that. <laughs> All right, Gabo, let's get out of here, bro. Bye. Good audios, everyone.